Hi everyone, it's Sylvia. How's everyone doing today? So today, we're, this is actually exciting. I love this painting, guys. This, we're gonna be an unboxing. Uh, it's called Fireworks Bloom by Lola Gonzalez. And look at that, guys. Oops. Okay, and it comes always in this beautiful box that is shiny. And this is a round, okay? Because it's like a reddish pinkish color. And it's also a circle. And on the side of the box, it says, scan me, unlock for 10%. And then in the back, <coughs> I have to cough again. I'm sorry, I apologize. It's the inside, what's inside the kit and how it works, okay? And then you know what? It's so funny. I've opened this box so many times and I just realized that it's in English. I believe this is French and Spanish. It's funny. Okay, anyway, so let's open up this baby. So what do we know about uh, Lola? Lola is a self-taught artist from Pennsylvania, guys. And she loves to work with alcohol ink. And she believes that uh, they are so vibrant working with alcohol ink. This is why she likes working with them, because they're vibrant. And when you mix them together, they sort of put up a fight. And you'll never know what color you will end up with. It's like a surprise. Okay, what's in here? Oh, the sticker. <coughs> okay. All right, so we have the kit, the toolkit. It comes with two stickers, and this is a small sticker. Okay, and it tells you basically Fireworks Bloom by Lola Gonzalez. It's a round, and this you can actually put on, it's a sticker as you can see. You peel it and you can put it on your box or you can put it on your logbook. <coughs> and here's a toolkit. Let's open up this baby. And like I mentioned before, earlier, or not earlier, in other videos, is that inside the toolkit, you never know what color pen you're gonna get, and, or a cover minder, or washi tape. So it's like a surprise. <coughs> Sorry, oh gosh, this cough. Okay. So we have the resealable bags, just in case you don't have the containers, you can put them in here. You have the diamond pen, it's a pink one, and you have the comfort grip. So you're supposed to stick this in here and it's supposed to help with your fingers, your hands when you're working. Okay, using the diamond pen, you see? Okay, so it just feels comfor comfortable. So that I think that's where they call it the comfort grip. All right, and of course it comes with washi tape. I'm, I'm sorry, <laughs> washi tape. It comes with the wax in a heart-shaped container. There's two of them in there. Look how pretty the washi tape is. It's like little yellow flowers. And then it comes with a cover minder. It's a pink flower. I believe this is the same one that I got. Let's see, it's over here somewhere. Where did I put it? Uh, I don't know where it is. But it's the same one that I got for the painting that I'm working on right now, which is called Rochelle. It's a mermaid. All right. And it comes with two uh, placers. And I believe this one is a four and this one's a seven. And of course the tray. And this is to prevent the you put it there and you prevent the drills from spilling out, which is nice. Comes in handy, guys, right? All right, so let's put everything in here. Let's put it aside. All right, and all the paintings, all the canvases come in a plastic bag. So when it's traveling, it uh, protects it. And it says Diamond Art Club, do what makes you sparkle. But I always say do what makes you happy. All right, let's open this baby up. It's a beautiful day here in Texas, guys. I just actually went for a walk with my husband and it was a, it's like a little windy, but it's just perfect outside. All right, so they all come with a thank you for your purchase, uh, what's included in the kit, tips and tricks and uh, inspiration just a few taps away, okay? So you download, download their app and you get, it says here, you get 20% off your first purchase through the app, iPhone or Android, which is pretty cool, guys. And here you have the big sticker. This one, I usually keep it in a, like in a small binder and the, the sticker I use inside my log book. All right, so here it is. Fireworks Bloom by Lola Gonzalez. Start date, end date, okay? And then of course it comes with individual pre-cut stickers. And as you can see, it has 53 colors. And I believe it has four ABs. Yep, four ABs, which is pretty cool. Here are the drills, and the drills always tell you the sticker. There's a sticker there. It tells you it's fireworks bloom, just in case you separate the drills 
from the painting, you'll know that these rules go with that beautiful painting. All right. So the canvas, like always, guys, is very, very smooth. All right. Let's see. Let's turn it around. And you can do this with this canvas because this is, um, is designed to prevent wrinkling and fraying. So it looks wrinkled a little bit, but if you leave it out and just leave it flat, it'll, it'll flatten, which is cool. Okay. This baby, oh my gosh. This is absolutely gorgeous, guys. Hopefully there's not a glare. Let me move this over here. Okay. So all the canvases has a picture on the bottom. It tells you DAC Diamond Art Club Fireworks Bloom. It's a 20 inches by 26 inches. It's 50.7 centimeters by 65.8 centimeters. Lola Gonzalez, Diamond Art Club. This is actually uh, um, considered a medium size painting, which is, I think, the perfect size. All right. And then in the middle, it basically says to take 10 for 10% off your next order. You can find them on Facebook and Instagram. And here it tells you it's lifetime warranty. So it's got a 30 day money back uh, guarantee. And it's got a free diamond spill insurance and a 10% cash back rewards with every order, guys, which is great. Okay, and then it has two legends. So we have a legend here on the... Oh, wait. Move this over here. I feel like you can see a glare. Okay, so you have a legend on the right-hand side, but it's on the bottom. And then you have another one on the top on the left-hand side. Okay? And then all the way in the top, it says, Do what makes you sparkle, Diamond Art Club. And if you look at the legend, it comes in handy because it tells you how many colors... So it's 53 colors. And in the middle, it tells you the symbols and the symbols are what's in the painting. And that's where you're gonna put your, dr your drills. And then of course, the color code. If you look at the color code, this is uh, up here. It's got one, two, three, four, which is four ABs. And that's, oops, four ABs are uh, Aurora Borealis. And they're just basically drills with extra coating that gives it a little more sparkle, okay? Now let's look at this beautiful painting, guys absolutely gorgeous i love love all the colors in this so what do we see this is basically uh it's like a flower actually it's not like a flower it is a flower and i see a glare it's a flower that they basically it looks like it's an up close uh picture of the flower and you can see that the flower is blossoming so it basically shows you how or what it looks like when a, when a flower is blossoming, okay? Sort of sort of like, it looks like an explosion of colors, all right? And then you see all these little white things that's coming out of the flower. That looks like pollen. I believe that's pollen that's just flying all over the flower or just flying and giving us allergies. <coughs> yeah, <laughs> sorry about that. Um, and what else? And the petals, if you look at the petals, the petals look like feathers, Is it, don't they? And uh, it's just beautiful. So it's sort of like they, the colors are mixing and creating their own explosion of color. Just beautiful, guys. And you see lots of purples down here, just different colors. Just very, very vibrant. All right, so let me bring this up so you can see it a little closer. And how clear it is. See that? They look, they look like feathers. There's the middle of the flower gorgeous this is just perfect now guys because spring is around the corner yep look at that all the purples all the yellows the pinks just absolutely gorgeous all right so let's look at the colors let's look at the drills okay. so let's begin 154 you have two of these this is grape very dark i think you can see them there all right 155 is blue violet medium dark 165, moss green, very light. 166, moss green, medium light. 210, lavender medium. That's pretty. 300 is mahogany, very dark. 307 is lemon. Okay. And then 310, we have three packets of 310, and this is black. 
Can we see it there? Yeah, we still have space. All right. 312 is baby blue, very dark. 315 is antique moth, medium dark. 321 is red. Very, very little of that one. 333 is blue, violet, very dark. 336 is navy blue. And 340 is blue, violet, medium. 498 is red, dark. 535 is ash gray, very dark. I mean, very light. Yeah, very light. 600 is cranberry, very dark. 601, cranberry, dark. 602, cranberry, medium. And 604, cranberry, um, light. So all of these four are all cranberries. Uh, 646 is beaver gray dark. And 666 is red bright. 718 is plum. Very little of that one. 720 is orange spice dark. And 780 is topaz ultra very dark. Can you see that there? Yeah. All right, 782 is topaz dark. And 793 is cornflower medium. And 799 is delf blue medium. 800 is delf blue pale. Lots of blues in this. 814 is garnet dark. 838 is beige brown very dark. 839 is beige brown dark. 895 is hunter green uh, very dark. And 898 is coffee brown very dark. All right, 915 is plum dark. That's pretty. 935 is avocado green dark. 938 is coffee brown uh, ultra dark. 939 is navy blue, very dark. 987 is forest green, dark. And 3064 is desert sand. Almost finished guys. 3346 is hunter green. 3347 is yellow green medium. And 3371 is black brown. Okay. And then this one here is 3607, and this is plum light. 3746 is blue violet dark. I don't think you can see those. I'll move this up a little bit, Just push it up a little bit. Yeah, I think you can see that. Okay. I'll just move this a little bit over here. 3835, grape medium. 3837, grape light. 3852, straw very dark. And the last one, 3857, rosewood dark. All right. So the, here we have all the colors except the ABs. But if you look at it, you have lots of purples, lots of pinks, lots of blues, lots of greens, lots of browns, and just a little bit of everything. Like we mentioned before, an explosion of color. All right, let's move this aside. And let's look at those beautiful ABs. So we have 100 AB, which is like a very, very pretty green. 113 is a pink. Wow, look at this one, guys. 126 is like a very, very light uh Violet. That's pretty. And 141 is white. Okay, so let's bring back the beautiful painting and let's figure out where these ABs go. All right, so now I'm gonna move this back again because of the glare. All right, so 
This one is 100. I mean, we look at the legend. 100 is symbol oops, number one. And of course, I dropped, excuse me, dropped an AB. So it's symbol one. Uh, it's going to be everywhere. See, you have ones here, you have ones here, ones here. It's going to be on all the petals. Well, not all the petals, wherever you see that green color. It's like a light, light green. So it's going to be here. It's going to be here in this petal and not down here because that's more purples. And you do have some green, some greens here. Ones here. Okay. And then the second one is 113 and that's going to be symbol two. And like I mentioned, everywhere you see like light, light, that light, light pink. So you have it here, up here, more over here, over here and this petal and this petal and some down here. There's twos there. There's twos down here. Twos down here. It's going to be all, everywhere. This is like really, really confetti heavy, guys. So if you love confetti, this is the painting for you. Uh, 126, this is going to be number three. So it's, oh my gosh, this is going to be beautiful. It's in the middle of the flower. And also this one is going to be the fourth one. It's the dot. So all this, guys, in the middle is going to be full of ABs. Wow. Can you imagine the sparkle? And then, of course, this little pollen, those are going to be ABs. So the, all, the, all the pollen is going to be shiny, sparkly. Wow. And where else do we have this one? This is the number three we said. So you have scat scattered. You have them scattered. And then you have threes on the petals. Yep. Wow. This is going to be absolutely gorgeous. All right. And if you love flowers, this is the one for you. And like I said, this is confetti heavy, which means that you're going to have to be changing drills a lot. All right. So I hope you love it because I love this painting. And I hope you guys all have a wonderful, wonderful rest of the week. Bye bye. And thank you.